this is weird um I haven't posted in three months I think <laughs> I had so much good vlogs planned for this year like so many gigs lots of events I was going to try and do some Halloween stuff as well but as we all know coronavirus happened postponed all of my gigs to next year I did try as you saw and do some lockdown vlogs yeah I wonder where they all went <laughs> I think I did about three and then I just didn't do anything in lockdown really I don't even know what to say because I chose the worst time to make this channel a vlogging channel but obviously I didn't know the whole pandemic was going to happen before I did that but I had so many gigs that I was going to I was going to New Hope Club I was going to Harvey I was going to Raksu I was going to see some of the road trip boys in like individually and it was just going to be great I was going to go see JLS big up JLS that's a JLS towel I thought you could see my wall sticker big up JLS <laughs> um, so it was just going to be great it was going to be full of gig content I was going to live my absolute best life and here we are this is a Shein try on haul I shop at Shein all the time basically like this hoodie hoodie this sweater is from Shein the rolls kind of the roll necks kind of gone weird but it's fine and it's got like balloon sleeves the first Shein item is it's got it's got a hair on it <laughs> is this star necklace it's kind of a choker i just wish it was a bit shorter maybe my neck is just thin <laughs> that's a weird saying um so it just hang it probably hangs like where like here um, I would wear it but I'm wearing like the completely wrong top to show you so moving onward great Disney film the next top is this it's a little tie-dye crop top it wouldn't be me if I didn't buy a crop top um, and I just wish it had more of that brown colour on the front this is the back of it um, and I could have definitely probably got it in a smaller size um, for Shein I get everything really big because I'm always scared about the sizings there because if you're a middle size I would say size up which I do for all of the clothing in there I just like the back more than the front <laughs> and it has like this little dip in the middle which I find really nice and it's got like scalloped edge very fancy word for me um, so yeah that is really nice it's actually quite soft and it's ribbed as well like the pattern I then bought 10 pairs of ankle socks I haven't actually opened this um, so we'll see oh wow they feel so soft okay these are one pair they're all different colors it has a little bear on the top of the foot i am a size six just saying let's put these on that won't be too bad let's <laughs> to be continued um i might just put one on there can't be much difference between my feet. Ooh, foot modeling. <laughs> I bet you didn't sign up for this, did you? Um, so yeah, it fits really well, like especially at the back. <laughs> I like it. It's a lot thicker than I thought. Um, yeah, that I got 10 pairs of these, so I am sorted. Um, I never used to wear, I call these ankle socks, but apparently these aren't the ankle socks. The ones that go over your ankles are ankle socks. So these are trainer socks, shoe sliders, I think that's what they call them in Primark. 
Um, but yeah, these were one size. That's why I showed you um, them and what size shoe I was. I was gonna say what size sock I am. Very good quality, fits a size six. I can't tell you if it fits other ones because um, I don't have multiple feet. <laughs> well, I have two, but you know. I thought this was gonna be a very short video. Turns out I can talk for quite a long time. So, um, let's move on. Um, I can't even find, <laughs> you can get lost in it. This is a oversized sweater. So, let me move back. <laughs> Um, I don't know if you saw all of that, I'm not sure, but I got this in a large. I definitely could have, I, th I feel like even a small probably could have fitted me. I can say that I wear this tucked in to my trousers, otherwise like tuck the front bit in. I haven't tried it all tucked in yet, but I think that might be okay. Otherwise, it looks like I'm wearing a sack of potatoes. It's a waffle texture. I can say I wish it was a bit thicker. Like you can see through that, you can see me. I did try it without a, a top, a vest top underneath and it was okay. But then again, I wasn't outside. So <laughs> um, I think it's just, your preference of of what you want to risk really because I feel like I might be too warm with just with this and a coat on so I might have to put a vest top underneath I can say when I took it off all I could hear was static so it is a very static material and if your static makes your hair like proper poof out then I don't think this is the one and lastly this one is also quite big, but here we are. I did get everything in a big size. It is a checkered flannel, mustard, yellow and black. I really like it. My friend Katie has one like this. This didn't say it was oversized, but I think it is quite a nice size for me. I am five foot eight as well. <laughs> so yeah, if you're five foot eight, middle sized, definitely just go bigger than your normal size at like a everyday high street shop um, because it's just better to be safe than sorry really. Um, this is quite thicker than I thought which is really nice. It feels like cargo material but a bit softer which is nice and the buttons on here are just nice white ones actually. Um, it does come with a spare button, which I find really good, like in this little bag. So yeah, I'm back. I don't know how long for. I'm praying that I'm going to get some autumn Halloween content for you guys, but I'm really not sure at the moment. I'm praying anyway. I'm going pumpkin picking soon, so there's either gonna be a vlog of that or a video of me decorating them which I'm kind of excited for. I did buy some paints. So yeah, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Well, this channel is meant to be a vlogging channel. I did change it, however, due to the current circumstances, I, I was gonna say that in the wrong order, I haven't been able to vlog in like ages. So I'm so sorry about that, but I'm hoping to get some Halloween content for you and hopefully by the end of this year, I'll have more content. I also bought a puppy. So if you want to see that, comment down below. If you want to see her, <laughs> um, give this video a like and comment down below. So thanks for watching. Thanks for sticking around. I know it's annoying when a YouTuber doesn't uh, upload when you've subscribed to them, so I'm so sorry. Give it a big thumbs up if you liked it. Ow. Please subscribe if you haven't already because that would mean a lot. I have lost a few subscribers, shock, um, since I haven't uploaded, so I'm so sorry about that. I also realise I've been looking at myself in the viewfinder throughout this whole video. Oops. Um, but yeah, I hope you have a lovely rest of your day, evening or night and I'll see you very soon. Bye! Then there's a hole between for you in the dark You should know you're beautiful just the way you are